Hey everyone, welcome to TechWire. In this video, we are going to solve problem number 72, edit distance. First, we will see the explanation of the problem statement, then the logic and the code. Now let's dive into the solution. So here we are given word 1 and word 2. We need to convert word 1 to word 2 by using these three operations. So I can delete a character, I can insert a character or replace a character. And by doing these operations, I need to find the minimum required operations to convert word 1 to word 2. Right? Which means there are many ways to remove, insert or replace characters. And I can convert this word horse to Ross. But we need to find the minimum number of operations required for this conversion. Right? So, for example, if I replace H with R and if I remove the center R and if I remove the end E. So, here I performed three operations. Right? I performed three operations. And there are other ways to, to convert this particular word 1 to word 2. There are many other possible ways. But that requires more operations for the conversion. So we need to minimize those operations. So that is what required here. Right? Now we will see how we are going to do this. So here I am going to solve this problem using dynamic programming approach. So initially I will create a matrix of 0. And the rows will be the length of my word 1 plus 1. And the column will be the length of my word 2 plus 1. Right, so I'm going to have two loops where I will be used to keep track of the rows and J will be the column index, right? So first we will start and then we will see what we are going to do at each and every step, right? So initially my zeroth index, the zeroth row will be having the column index, right? So I'm going to be having 0, 1, 2 and 3 then the zeroth column so we saw zeroth row had the values of columns right so, and this zeroth column will have the values of rows so we are going to just replace the row values corresponding row values right so this will be the starting matrix for us so we will start from iterating from first row and first column right so we will first update this particular value so when we are updating i will show you guys what we are doing here right now let's start so initially i'm going to check i minus one index in my word one and j minus one index in my word two and i will check whether they are equal Right? So, word i-1 is nothing but the h character and word 2 j-1 is nothing but the r character. And they are not equal, then I will move to the next condition. Now, I will take the i-1 and j-1 column value. Which is i-1 row and j-1 column. I need to pick that value. So here I'm going to get 0. I minus 1 is 0 row and J minus 1 is the 0 and 0th column. And I need to pick that value which is nothing but 0. Then I will pick I row and J minus 1 column. So here I row is first column. Here, here I is 1. And the J minus 1 is nothing but the 0th column. That is 1 here. So I will pick 1 here. Then I need to pick i minus 1 row and jth column. I need to pick 3 values. So i minus 1 row is 0, 0th row and j is first column. j is equal to 1. So which is nothing but 1 here. Then I will take a minimum of these 3 values. So in this case it's going to be 0 and I will add 1. 
so i'm going to get one year then then i'm going to take this value and replace and i'm going to update that value in my matrix in the corresponding i throw j -th column that is one comma one here i will update in one comma one as one right i will show you guys in the next iteration what we are updating right next my j will be two so i need to check i minus one character and the j minus one character so here i minus one character is h j minus one character is o right now i need to check whether h and o character is equal no they are not equal since they are not equal i will pick the three values and i will take minimum of those three values so those three values nothing but i minus one and j minus one and i throw and j minus one column and i minus one column and j throw i need to pick these three values from a dp matrix then i will take minimum of that and i will add one to it and i will update that in my dp matrix so here i updated few values and i will show you guys when the characters are equal right when the characters are equal so currently i am in second row and second column here right now i need to check my i minus one character which is nothing but o and j minus one character that is nothing but o itself when both characters are equal i will update with i minus one row and j minus one column from my dp matrix so here i need to go to my first i minus one is one first row and j minus one is first column so i will go to this value and i will update two comma two with this value one right so what we are trying to do here so we know our row represents the word one and the column represents word two right so we know we are at the i row and jth column this is nothing but two comma two i is nothing but the second index in my first word and so if i try to slice word one from zero to i what i will get i will not include i index so we will be getting h and o here right then if i try to slice word two from zero to jth index we know our column is represented by j and the row is represented by i so here j is nothing but 2 if i try to slice word 2 from 0 to 2 i will get r and o so here we have one right this one represents minimum operation i need to perform within this substring of characters so if i try to convert word one to word two what i need to do here within this substring what i need to do i need to remove i need to perform a remove operation that's it i don't have to do anything in this particular substring i don't have to do anything i need to perform only one that one is nothing but this value one operation i need to perform if i try to convert we are not converting perfectly because we are only checking the substring here but at least i need to perform within this substring if i try to convert i need to remove h right then i will add r in front of the in the upcoming stages but within this substring i need to remove r that's all we need to do here in this particular stage so as we increase our characters we will be performing the minimum number of operations at that stage right so at the end so after performing all of the operations after checking all of my characters i will get three at the end of my matrix that's all we are doing here now let's see the code
So before we go, if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel, please like and subscribe. This will motivate me to upload more videos in future and also check out my previous videos and keep supporting guys. So initially I'm going to have M and N, which is nothing but the length of my word one and the length of my word two. Then I'm going to create my DP matrix, right? Which is nothing but I'm going to have n columns and m rows m plus 1 right then I'm going to update my dp matrix and I, I will be iterating through the row and columns right from m plus 1 row and n plus 1 columns then if i am in the i row i will update with column numbers in my dp which is nothing but j itself then if i am in the zeroth column i will update with the row values Then I will check my characters in my word 1 and word 2. If they are equal, I will update that particular i throw and jth column with the i minus 1 and j minus 1 value. else I will take and update my current i throw and jth column with the minimum of my i minus 1 and j minus 1 value then i and j minus 1 value then I will take the i minus 1 and j th column value then i will add one to it then finally my result will be at the end end row and column that's all the codes now let's run the code the so the time complexity with is order of n m into n and space is order of m into n as well Thank you for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe. This will motivate me to upload more videos in future and also check out my previous videos. Keep supporting. Happy learning. Cheers guys.